question, but we seemed uh, right before we got news of this to be uh, bouncing off some of those lows. Uh, people started to hear this news, of course, on Twitter, actually, right. as one of the first places. The Boston Globe came out and said that there were these two powerful explosions uh, at the site of the marathon, at the finish line, uh, in fact. Um, and you can see the video now, a lot of chaos obviously ensuing. Uh, and by the way, you, you, we, we should also point out that there are still very, you're seeing the National Guard there trying to work to uh, uh, clean the mess. There are still so few uh, uh, people that are on the scene, uh, first responders who are able to, to try to make sense of this. Again, this is all live. We're witnessing this together in real time. This has just happened in Boston. And this is, of course, a very big deal in Boston, uh, a very big deal in New England, and, and even nationally as well, this marathon, uh, very well known. It's actually had, uh, interestingly enough, on uh, Patriots Day, which is today. It's the third Monday in April. Um, and, you know, they have just people that come from all over the world to participate in this. Uh, thousands of, of spectators, um, roughly half a million spectators, it's, it uh, brings in every year. Um, and, and by and the way, thousands of runners. Thousands of runners, thousands of spectators. And curious to note as we look at these live photos that the police have been very effective at moving people away from where the explosions uh, seem to have occurred. Again, we're not seeing a lot of uh, smoke. Uh, what we are seeing however is clearly consternation on the ground as people try to come to grips with what has just happened and more importantly uh, why it's happened uh, this could simply be a natural gas explosion that happened because of a pipe where we don't know yet uh, it could be something related to uh, the T which is Boston's own underground the, the subway there may have been an electrical fire again so many questions uh, we're trying to get some people on the ground who can describe uh, what's happening there yeah.